So, we're in Hailsham, which is a little village. It's not a village, it's like undersells it, probably more of a small town. Yeah. Um, just north of Eastbourne, that's how I describe it to people so they know where it is. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, we're a little independent firm, try and keep everything local, personal, um, you know, something I like is supporting other local businesses, so I like to get really involved in the local community, um, things that are going on, we sponsor local events, um, you know, being part of that community, giving back as well as making yeah. money out of it, yeah, obviously, exactly. you know, that's what we're there for, isn't it? What got me into it was I was working in hospitality and spent a long time um, working weekends at work when all my friends are out, missing things, not enjoying it, earning, earning minimum wage, which probably at the time was like £5.50 an hour, <laughs> yeah. I think it was, great. Um, and I thought, I'm sick of this, I want something else. And I think when you're growing up, you always have this idea in your brain that, you know, if estate agents, they've obviously got loads of money, they always look very nice. Um, they get to rock, <laughs> rock round in a suit all day, <laughs> yeah, lovely picture. driving a Mercedes, <laughs> like, what else could I want? Yeah. So there I was, working at a restaurant, and absolutely sick of it. So, went on Indeed or something like that, um, and saw a trainee estate agency role in Kent, actually I started, um, in New Romney. I was living in Rye at the time. And I was like, stuff it, I'm going to apply for it, let's go for it. What's the worst that's going to happen? Um, applied for it, met with the area manager. He was very much, he had had the same background as me, started in hospitality, fell into a state agency and done very well at it. Um, and I sort of have followed suit from there. So I only lasted two years in corporate agency. I didn't really like that corporate agencies felt to me to be anything but a state agency. Um, so left there, found there was an independent firm, Stevens and Carter, where I am now. Um, they were advertising a role. I applied for it, got the job, and that was six and a half years ago. And wow. this year, no, end of last year, I bought into the firm. So Amazing. I'm obviously doing something right. We use three portals. So you've got Right Move, Zoopla, and On the Market. Um, we get more support as in time and attention, I don't know what better word there probably is, from on the market than we do all the others. You know, on the market costs us 10% of what Rightmove costs us a month, yet I have more face-to-face -face time with Nicola than I do from anybody at Rightmove. I am wanting to leave you very shortly and go and speak to Repit because I've been with Auto, Auto Live is it called, something like that, that we use. Um, and here we are four years on, it's a cloud-based system, and we still have a real issue with lagging. Okay. So absolutely open to new software, one that works, one that doesn't lag. Yeah. Yeah. We're, running, we're running on, is it terabyte internet connection or whatever it is? 100 megabytes per second, oh, God knows, we've got like the best internet money can buy and we still have a lag. Um, so absolutely, I think a lot of agents will be grateful to have somewhere else to go to.